I get it now. I get it. Today, we're reviewing the HTC Fuse phone. It's got a touchscreen, Wi Fi, and supports Microsoft Office. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. What the what? hell just happened over there? Was that a nerd fight? Scott Michelle said an entire sentence. Yeah, someone's rolling a 20 sided die to settle it. When you're in the audience, you dorks. scream out like keywords. It was supposed like... to be, ooh. Ah. <laughs> Let's just see if this is worth it. Windows Mobile on a touchscreen isn't always perfect. But what happens when you add a full keyboard? You get the HTC Fuse. Taking after the Touch Diamond, the Fuse includes a 3.2 megapixel camera, Microsoft Office support, Wi-Fi, and the Touch Flow interface. But it's the full QWERTY keyboard that makes everything easier. Experience complete productivity for $299 with a contract. All right, we have reviewed a lot of touch phones this we month, have. the Omnia, the Crave. Mm -hmm. uh, so what do you think makes the Fuse stand out, if anything? How about this little guy right here? Oh, hold on. There it is. You were holding it the wrong way. Full QWERTY keyboard. How about that? Um, look, the, 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 the sliding is actually one of the best things about this phone. Sorry, really, I did a disservice. Really, but don't you think that it feels weird um, when you slide? Well, here, yeah, here's the thing. We noticed right away the phone size. Uh, it really it just feels heavy. It looks heavy. like you're the, oh, your old Nokia N95. It does, yeah, and that's not a good thing. Uh, it's thick. It's 5.8 ounces, over half an inch thick. And the 2.8 inch touchscreen looks good, but it might seem a little small considering the bulk of the phone. I mean, for a device this size, you'd expect a larger screen. Will not feel good in the old pantalones. Okay, so this has been called the successor to the Tilt. Yeah. So do you think it's uh, a good replacement? Uh, technically, yes. The phone has pretty much all the features well, of the Tilt. Yes. It means, means like on paper. Really no. Yeah, and that's what I'm getting to. I mean, because it's got a QWERTY keyboard, 3G, GPS. It adds a better touch screen, a slightly upgraded 3.2 megapixel camera. So for the technically portion of my sentence, that's that. <laughs> it does use this touch flow 3D that's supposed to help you navigate the main menu and cycle through photos. You can zoom into web pages uh, with it using finger gestures. The problem is that it's sort of a tacked on kind of theme or interface that feels slow and, and inaccurate at times. And it's running on top of Windows Mobile, which everybody's gripe is to begin with is that it's mm. kind of slow and inaccurate. So yeah. you put the two together and it's not good. It's not good. And, and they give you a stylus for this phone as well. And, you know, I had somebody. Uh, you got people got mad at you. There was a viewer crawling up the old dirt pipe last time I reviewed something and talked about a stylus. Yeah. And he was like, why are you slamming the stylus? It really helps with using things. And the reason we slam it is because these phones are designed to be used with touch. There is a touch screen. Yeah, and when you have to resort to the stylus because they haven't updated certain user interface elements and you still have to get here to maybe press really a little X or whatever, that's not cool. But maybe you that guy really it. likes 1995. No, look, he, I get it. I get it. You like your Excel spreadsheets yeah. and you like poking around with your stylus and that's okay. cool. I understand it. You shouldn't need it to use the phone. Okay, well, you're talking about like the, you know, the problems uh, with the phone and the whole Windows Mobile thing going yes. on with it. But that's the case. I mean, it seems that every phone with Windows Mobile has, you know, some problems. So can yeah. you really fault that one? Yes. For, oh, okay. <laughs> I, think, I think we can. I mean, no, it's a valid question, but yes, we can. They all have that problem. Yeah, and, and only because the TouchFlow software gives you the impression specifically that you should be able to use your hands with this device, you know, through and through. Uh, the keyboard feels good to type. I'll give it that. It does, it does work well uh, to supplement the, the mediocre touchscreen. Unfortunately, it feels less like a perk in this case and more like a necessity. You really, the, the on-screen software Do keyboard like is just tiny. Uh, the keyboard feels good to me. No, yeah. This, the sliding. Oh, the slide is, I, I, like, I'm here nor there on it. It doesn't yeah. feel like the most solid thing in the world, but uh, I mean, I, yeah. I haven't used it that extensively, but the keyboard yeah. itself feels good. Okay, so do you think that this phone can, you know, hold a light to, like, you know, the iPhone, the G1, or new Blackberries out there? Nope. Oh. The only advantage of the Windows mobile software is having access to Microsoft Office. So adding the, like a so-so touchscreen and a, and a pretty solid keyboard, uh, it's, it's just it's a disadvantage. The touchscreen's a disadvantage here. Uh, the bulky size prevents it uh, from feeling as compact as it should as well. Mm -hmm. I like a larger screen, slightly slimmer device. And if not you're not going to do touch right, just don't, don't do it. Okay. Okay. What's your God. rating? Stop making phones like that, Olivia. Oh, I'm not. 81% B minus. Right. Like, if you want to get someone a smartphone that plays well with their work, we would highly recommend the BlackBerry Bold. I would love the BlackBerry yeah. Bold. Anybody have Blackberries out there? You know I support you. It's Bold. sleeker. It's got a better operating system, and most important, it's the same price. So, I want one. look, I like HTC a lot. I want to like their phones. This one just misses the mark. Sorry, guys. Well, that's it for today's Gadgetron. But our holiday gift guide will be back again tomorrow with more of the best gifts under 300 bucks.